This is Ozark's Fox AM. Good morning and welcome to Ozark's Fox AM from the historic, the historic theater that we love, the Landers Theater. I feel like I'm at home right here, Kelly. I'm Jeremy Rabe. And I'm Kelly Smith. Thank you so much for joining us. We are so excited to be here at the historic Landers Theater. And of course, we have our beautiful friend, Megan Buckbinder, here this morning early. Hi, guys. Good morning. Well, we are here. Let me tell you why we're here, first of all. We love the historic Landers Theater. We love all the productions. And a special reason is that Color 10 and Ozarks Fox were actually sponsoring, underwriting the production of Hello, Dolly, starring the amazing Broadway star Kim Crosby who we are so lucky to have in the Ozarks. I mean, can you can you believe it? I know that the fact that we have this Broadway artist and she's giving her time to be on our stage and, and in our productions is I mean it's another level which is amazing. Me yeah. Megan do you, I know she does a few of these things here and there. Do you feel like should we ask her should we not? And she, I know she loves doing them so. She loves it yeah and I think I mean I don't want to speak for her I think, I'm assuming she loves it because she keeps coming yes. back to do more but she grew up here. Yes. This was her home stage. This was um, where she kind of learned how um, all of her skills started here. And her family was a part of the Landers and, and part of Springfield Little Theater. So it's kind of like a coming home for her as well. And we are more than welcome to open our doors anytime <laughs> she wants to come. Yeah. Right. And speaking of the Landers Theater, I know you have a lot of different um, fundraising campaigns throughout the year. And right now you're doing one that's really, really cool. Tell us about it. Yes. Yeah, so um, Springfield Little Theater has had a huge growth spurt in the last five years, I would say. Mm -hmm. um, we purchased um, a building just about a mile down the road, the old McDaniel School, in the summer. So it's now called the Judith Enyart Reynolds School of the Performing Arts for Springfield Little Theater. So this building now houses all of our education department. Well, we bought it for $1.37 million, just a small amount. Right. Um, and we've raised 1.25, which is amazing. Yeah, yeah. so we have only $120,000 left only. <laughs> and we have a new charter school, or magnet school, um, partnership with Springfield Public Schools happening in the fall. Um, which is an incredible opportunity to see Academy of Fine and Performing Arts. Mm -hmm. um, and so upcoming fifth graders can come to school at with Springfield Little Theater and get an arts education as integrated into their you know regular education. So we're raising money to completely pay off and erase our debt with the Judy in the month of February. It's called the Bigger Picture Campaign about how people can be the bigger picture, not just for Springfield Little Theater, but now for the arts and arts education in Southwest Missouri, because there's nothing like this anywhere else in this area. So $10 is all we're asking from people, and they can upload a photo on our website um, and be a part of this massive bigger picture. You like that little play yes, on words? That's right. That's right. <laughs> a big, a, a be a part of the bigger picture. Um, and it's a big mosaic of a painting of the Judy, is what we call the building, is the Judy. Um, and so they can actually show people, and it'll live in the Judy for years to come so they can walk in and see I was I helped pay off this building and I was I believed in the arts and arts education that much so that's um, that's what we're doing for the month of February so the photo that you upload yeah. will go into that mosaic so you're gonna be there Forever, and forever. And part of what's yep. happening here, mm -hmm. and how great this shows how much our community loves the arts that you were able to right. raise as much as you have already. Exactly. Yeah, and just I mean, it is obvious through the Landers and the sh the shows that we do here that it, this community supports the arts and mm -hmm. is supportive of the performing arts in general. Um, but now we're going into a whole other realm of arts education and the next generation of arts performers. And it's not just about the future Broadway artists. It's about um, the soft skills that they're learning um, so these are the people you want to employ they're confident they're mm -hmm. um, they can think on their feet they you know they know how to work together so it's mm -hmm. it's the stuff that they're learning there is way more important than just their future career in they're in that right. I mean they're becoming little human beings <laughs> <laughs> they are well-rounded <laughs> theatrical human beings yes. uh, Megan you said that they can upload upload a photo and you can donate what is the website that people go to to get because I kind of want to do that now with my photo I want to be up yeah. on that wall yeah. right now oh, it's, it's super yeah. easy go to our website springfieldlittletheater.org right on the home page you can click on the bigger picture um, literally says donate to the bigger picture and it'll take you to that part and it makes it super easy it's, and you can choose ten dollars per photo so if you wanted to upload a hundred Photos. Well, I was going to ask you that. Can you, you can. get a couple of different photos you on can. there? Yes. You $10 can. $10 is nothing. I know my dog will be in there. I was just going to say that, Megan. 
I literally was going to say my four dogs, my yeah. two cats, and me. Yeah. All those photos. There, yep, Murphy's in there Your multiple times. <laughs> so, and so if you have multiple children or if you want to honor somebody, like yeah. I'll be uploading a picture of my grandmother who um, I used to go to um, the Nutcracker with and oh. Broadway shows with when I was younger. And so to kind of honor her, she'll, her and I will be in there. You know, there's just a lot of different ways you can do it um, to support. And so that's, um, it's super easy and it every $10 counts. If 10 people pay $10, right and then got 10 more people to give $10. Yeah. I mean, just think about how many people yeah. come to our shows or how many people are on our Facebook page or how many people are watching at home. If everyone gave $10, yeah. that $120,000 does not seem so much. It'll, it'll come to you like that. Yeah. You know, yeah. and we're standing here in the beautiful lobby, yes, but you are. know your stage is so beautiful. What if we take a little walk? Yeah. Walk with Let's us, guys. Okay. Come on in. You're walking through the lobby. This is how you see the show. You, this beautiful, oh. it's just so historic, and I love that the historic charm is still here. You have not tried to change oh, no. the character no. of the theater. No, definitely not. We, um, we are very proud to be um, the stewards of this beautiful historic building. I mean, it sh uh, gosh, she was built in 1909. So she's an old one, but, <laughs> <laughs> but she's doing well. And we're, that's what the capital campaign that is currently going on, the general campaign, the Judy was a part of that, but mm -hmm. is restoring the Landers. And we take that very seriously and I'm very excited about that. Yes. Yeah. And, and, you know, uh, it's, it is truly gorgeous. When you just look around, the ornateness of it, it's just absolutely beautiful. It's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Thanks, right. Megan. All right. We're going to talk with you in just a little bit more. Great. In a little bit uh, later, but right now we want to check in with Elisa Rafa to see how the weather is right now. Elisa?